I breathe in for two counts, out for two counts. My feet lightly tap the ground in a rhythm, heel to toe, heel to toe. Music pumps into my brain, pushing me farther. Exercise is an important part of my daily life, and with obesity on the rise, it is more and more important for Americans to raise their heart rates and put down the bag of chips. According to the CDC, more than one-third of American adults are obese, while 12.5 million children ages only two to Just within the past 20 years, obesity has been on the rise and has continued to remain high. Not only can exercise control weight, but it can greatly, greatly decrease your chance for other conditions such as heart disease, stroke, and type 2 diabetes. Even a simple brisk walk can help improve your mood and boost energy if done regularly. In this way, you can be less stressed and gain an overall healthy mind. However, I completely understand barriers to starting this and keeping at it. Who really has time to spend half an hour to an hour of exercise every day? It starts with priorities and thus lifestyle habits. A healthy weight can improve not only your quality of life, but can help you live longer. Mayo, Mayo Clinic puts this in the best perspective. What's more important than living longer? This investment, as they term it, is well worth your while. More, Mayo recommends viewing exercise and eating well just as important as something such as sleep. Maybe instead of just watching TV, you go for a walk instead. I challenge you to set time aside, if just for one night, to go for a walk or a jog or anything to get you moving. It may even help to write it on your calendar. Many people think that exercise is boring and thus making it harder and longer. I struggled this, with this myself when I decided that I should start running. How do I keep myself entertained on a machine? Do I just stare at the wall? Like, I don't know what else to do. I just realized that it was better for me to maybe run outside when it was nice. And in the winter, I would just vary my workouts by going to the gym or doing Pilates in my dorm room. Choose an activity that will be enjoyable to you. And if you like tennis, walking the jog, swimming, go for it. That's all active. It may even help to do something like walking with your friends. In this way, it'll keep you accountable for working out as well as having a buddy to do it with. And you may even look forward to it. Unfortunately, we all struggle with being self-conscious. I used to be terrified of the gym, going there and sweating, everyone would see me be disgusting, and it, I hated the thought of it. I started going really late at night or really early in the morning to avoid the crowds, and many of my workouts were done in my tiny dorm room. <laughs> I truly understand this barrier to exercising. I challenge you to focus on more how you feel after you finish the workout, and how much stronger you are after each time you exercise. Home exercise equipment is great as well. And work out while you're watching TV or um, watching the game, the Guilty Pleasure TV or the news, but most of all focus on the future and the healthy life that every one of us deserves to live. Many people, I understand, however, work long days. <laughs> After working the entire day, the last thing I want to do is try and do some sit-ups or go on a jog. I work from 8 in the morning to 5 at night and sometimes go shadow at the hospital afterwards, so I completely understand this barrier. The last thing on my mind is working out. Try exercising in the morning. Some of my favorite runs are in the cool mornings with just me and the birds chirping. Um, again, you could hop on the treadmill or elliptical while watching the news and bring some tennis shoes to work and maybe go on a lunch walk. Or if it's motivation that's troubling you, it may be good to pack some clothes, either go to work for after work, or pack them before you leave and then come back. And that way it'll get your mind thinking that you do need to be working out. Have that exercise video cued when you get home. Most of all, though, don't forget that sleep can make a huge difference between a sluggish day and a happier one. In conclusion, remember that living a healthy lifestyle and exercising is important. While it does help you maintain a healthy weight, it will improve your perspective on life and thus give you energy. It'll be great. So what are you waiting for? Grab your tennis shoes, grab the exercise video, and schedule yourself a date with a healthier you.